Welcome back, everyone, to Out of the Park Baseball 21 Ari Angels franchise. I was going to say Arizona Dimebacks, but it's been a while since we did that one. Uh, and we are continuing right where we left off here in May 22 and 13, fighting out with the Astros for the division were game out, and they seem to have everything together this year, except for Forrest Whiteley is struggling quite a bit. But we have our own problems over here in Anaheim. Gio Gonzalez and De La Cruz are not really pitching that well. Of course, De La Cruz, he had a rough first start. His second start was a lot better. So we're going to actually be able to see here uh, what we can do to help him out. We're going to call up Keller real quick. Uh, but we're going to see what De La Cruz can do for us in his third MLB start. And it didn't really go that well. Four and one thirds. He gave up five runs. His ERA is at eight ten. So De La Cruz is going to be sent to long relief. Dylan Bundy will move up in the rotation along with Sandoval uh, because they've both been pitching as expected. We're going to move Dylan Peters to the rotation behind Gio Gonzalez. And we're going to have Felix Pena go in as a sixth man right now. And we're going to give them some starts and see how they do. We're also going to go over here and send down probably, well, I guess we'll just go with a very limited uh, bullpen for now. Just to, until we... Get Gonzalez one more start here and see if he can improve or not. Uh, so it looks like he's not improving. First of all, we got an offer for Engler for Garrett Williams. No, we'll reject that deal. And it looks like Tom Murphy had a three home run game. So that's pretty cool. So Gonzalez not improving at all. We're going to have to ship him off because he's just not pitching like he was in spring training. He had a one ERA in spring training. He was very good for us, but eight starts into this year, it's obvious he doesn't have what it takes to be in our rotation anymore, and we don't have time to, to mess around with projects. I did see Danzy Swanson pop up. That's interesting. A few names coming up that I noticed. Uh, Roberto Osuna we could pick up. Pick up Gene Segura, former Angel prospect. Dansby Swanson was with the Pirates. This would be an interesting move. I actually really like Dansby Swanson. We could get Manny Machado too, but Swanson is cheap. 840k. Tremendous upside. Uh, you know, he hasn't like really developed into a star yet, but he could still. So I actually really like this deal. And I wonder if I can get a reliever. Oh, I can get Orchid. They really like Gio Gonzalez. Wow. All right. What else can I get? Okay. Pirates overpaying for a terrible starting pitcher. That is actually pretty realistic. Chad Cool? No. Well, what would make it work? Oh, okay. Anyone. <laughs> Anyone with a pulse. All right, so let's just rip off the Pirates real quick and do this deal. We're going to send Gio Gonzalez and Jake Lee for Swanson, Okert, Brault, and Chad Cool. And that is a great deal. Chad Cool also has tremendous upside, you know. And considering what happened with Garrett Cole as soon as he left, left Pittsburgh, um, Cole could turn into a really good pitcher for us. So we'll send down De La Cruz to start. That will be our first decision. We're obviously going to bring Swanson over and Orkit as well uh, for our bullpen. But we need to make room for Cole and Brault, which if we send down Hermosillo... Hermosillo is not playing very much. So I think we'll send Hermosillo down. 
and we'll bring Brault in. Middle relief. And then depending on Peters and Pena, Cole will come in and start some games. So Dylan Peters will be out for five games, so that solves that right away. Chad Cole, there we go. We'll throw Cole into the rotation. And Pena should get the start here. See how Pena does. Pena did pretty pretty good actually. Five innings, one earned run. That's actually really good. Let's see what Chad Cole does. Is he rested? No, he's not. Okay, we'll we'll give him extra time and see what he can do for us in the rotation. Looks like Tampa Bay Rays get Hermosillo off waivers, so he's officially off our roster. Noel Ramirez is back. So who is not pitching well? Orkit is not pitching very well for us. Starlin Castro really has not played at all. Which is kind of unfortunate, but... I think that now that we have Swanson, Castro is kind of not a relevant piece for us anymore. So I think we can send Castro off to another team. And I don't really care about the return. I'll take really anyone that's halfway decent that I can just throw in the minor leagues. I saw Sterling Sharp. He did really well in David Knight's uh, team when we were doing the Nationals Astros franchise, but it looks like this game he didn't develop. So we'll pass on him. Carlos Martinez, Paul Goldschmidt. I want a minor leaguer. Somebody young and cheap. Uh, 21-year-old Dusty Jackson. Sure, we'll do that. That's a quick little fix for us, and we can... I wonder where he went. I don't even see him on any roster. All right, well, hope. Oh, he's on. Wonderful. All right, well, hopefully we can just send him straight to AAA. There we go. Okay. So he's on the AAA team. That's fine. And then injured list, we can bring back Ramirez. Throw him into the bullpen. And we'll have Brault be a lefty specialist. And we'll continue simulating here as Noel Ramirez will be out for one to two weeks again. Oh my gosh, this is really annoying. We'll go ahead and bring up... Markel. Yeah, we'll bring up Markel. Why not? Because it's just endless injuries, it seems like. So halfway through May, we're still uh, battling it out with the Astros. Ramos is back, so Markel has actually pitched well, but he'll go down. Ramos is back. He can go into middle relief, and we will continue. we got the player draft coming up. Man, we are deadlocked with the Astros, and the Mariners are right there. They're actually having a pretty good season as well. Dylan Peters is back, and Pena has not been too good in the rotation. So I think we're going to send Pena down. No, we'll send Keller down. We'll put Pena back in the bullpen. Keller will go down. Keller has not been good for us. We'll put Peters in the rotation and see how he does. He didn't really get an opportunity to pitch. And we can Pena as long relief. And we'll go like that. That will work. All right. So, yeah, the Mariners are right there with us as well. Three and a half games. And honestly, this whole division is actually pretty competitive still. The worst team is the A's, and they're only three games under 500. They're six and a half back. So, this division is still really up for grabs for anyone. Ramirez is back for the 150th time. 
Uh, Pena, 18 games, three starts, has a 7.57 ERA. It's time to go to the minor leagues. You're just, you're not doing it for me at all. Uh, Dylan Peters is not really doing that well in the rotation, unfortunately, but we don't really have that many options. Chad Cole is pitching great for us, by the way. A 2.67 ERA and four starts for us. Told you he'd figure it out. Did not take much. So we're in June. We are tied for first place. Thanks for watching. Be sure to like and subscribe. And let me know if you have any suggestions.